Hi, it's Rachel Tappin here. I'm the proud owner and founder of Blue Boo and Media Matchmaker. So can you believe the World Wide Web is 30 years old today? Goodness me, that shows my age as well. What did we do before? But it's been fantastic, hasn't it? I mean, it's transformed our lives, hasn't it? And how we connect uh, to other people and how we find our information. And the world that I work, live in and, and that's my life and my passion is, is working with the media. So the way that journalists now report the news, you know, the way that they uh, write their articles, um, it's just all so changed and thanks to the World Wide Web. So if you are missing a trick, I just want to tell you how simple it can be to get what you're currently doing in your marketing and get it out there to the World Wide Web, to the media journalists, so, you know, I'm sure you've already got great content, but if you stuck for content, it's easy these days to think about what you can talk about. Even LinkedIn, I'll share with you, give you suggestions on what articles you can be talking about. So, for example, let's move these out of the way. This is what people are talking about, you know, the growing anxiety economy, the web is a dysfunctional founder. Um, you know, that's Tim celebrating, you know, the 30 years, but saying it's got the, you know, the dark side to it as well. But let's look at the positive side. But what you can do is take great content that's already out there and give it your spin on it and talk to the media about it but there's also great ways you can see what's trending on Twitter it's really easy to see what's trending on Twitter or simply go to BBC new websites or what other websites are out there that you can get ideas from but there's also things that you can do to forward plan so there's national celebration days for literally nearly everything there's 400 and 400 celebration days in the UK and worldwide um, and these are if you're accessing to my club 100 you'll have access to these but we've got coming up in March nutrition and hydration week we had international women's week last week it was crafts as well certain things they celebrate all the time so next week if you have a next week if you have a story that you can know will connect to nutrition and hydration week write the story write the article and get it out there now if you need any help with the media contacts this is where it's so simple journalists want trending stories they want stories that have a different angle that are fresh that, that match their audience so think about where you want to be write the content and then I can simply help you get it out there um, the journalists now you'll find every single journalist is part of most media databases and this is what PR agencies use you can have access to your own media database so let's say for example you were in health and you could write about that anxiety story you might say right okay I want to speak to the national newspapers um, that write about just the journalists that write about health. So you could look under health and you could say, right, okay, just health in general, and it might be homeopathy. So you might be a homeopath healer or something. So you can search for them and it will give you the list of all of the journalists basically that write about health. Um, on, on that side so they tell you what they write about their health and fitness and if they're given to us as well we'll have their social media contact details too so this one we've got their twitter account this one here we've got their link uh, the, yeah the email account or we've got their email account here sometimes we get their linkedin their twitter account whatever they've given to us now what we can recommend you do is you search for your um journalists by what they write about or it might be you want to get onto radio so you can search for the BBC producers and you literally create your list so you could create these in advance and you literally then send a press release or an email to introduce yourself with your story it's that simple PR doesn't have to be difficult and now because of thank you to the World Wide Web we've got access digitally to all of the media contacts that write about specific things so if you think about something like The Guardian or the mail that have 100 200 journalists working for them you want to reach the right type of journalists so if you want to get your content out to the world wide web but more importantly to communities that already have great followers and that is your tribe um, just consider taking your um, current newsletters or the newsletters or the articles you're going to write and distribute it out via the media via the world wide web anyway i'll leave you to it take care